Albatross's Masters of Ocean Gliding, the Albatross truly embodies the spirit of the open ocean. These magnificent birds are renowned for their incredible flight capabilities. They can travel astonishing distances over water without ever needing to land, sometimes covering thousands of miles in a single foraging trip. Imagine soaring effortlessly above the waves, guided by wind and instinct, searching for food across vast stretches of the Pacific or Atlantic. Their wingspans, which can reach up to 11 feet, are the largest of any bird on Earth. This allows them to glide with remarkable efficiency, minimizing energy expenditure as they navigate the skies. They essentially surf the winds, using dynamic soaring techniques to gain altitude and cover immense ground, a truly breathtaking feat of natural engineering. Stick around. You're about to learn something wild. But first, tap like and hit subscribe so you don't miss the next mind. To truly appreciate an albatross mastery of flight, you need to understand just how remarkable their wings are. These birds have evolved some of the largest wingspans in the entire animal kingdom, typically averaging between 10 and 12 feet. That's longer than most people are tall. This isn't about brute strength. It's a testament to incredible evolutionary engineering. Those long, slender wings aren't just impressive to look at. They allow albatrosses to exploit something called dynamic soaring. Essentially, they use the wind patterns over the ocean surface to gain altitude and travel vast distances with astonishing efficiency, requiring very little flapping. This ability is absolutely critical because these birds undertake some of the longest migrations on Earth. What's truly astonishing about an albatross flight is how efficiently it covers vast distances. They don't just rely on flapping their wings, they master a technique called dynamic soaring. Imagine the ocean as a layered cake with different temperatures and wind speeds at each layer. Albatrosses are incredibly sensitive to these subtle shifts, what we might call wind gradients. They find areas where faster air flows over slower air, allowing them to gain altitude and speed without expending much energy. It's like riding an invisible wave, constantly seeking out upward currents and converting wind energy into forward momentum. This ability allows them to travel thousands of miles with minimal effort, truly demonstrating a remarkable adaptation for life on the open ocean. Most birds soaring over the ocean depend on rising columns of warm air thermals to stay aloft. But albatrosses have a truly remarkable strategy for long distance flight. They're masters of harnessing wind energy in ways other birds simply can't. Instead of just waiting for thermals, they actively seek out and expertly ride breaking waves and wind shear those sudden shifts in wind direction and speed near the surface of the water. This allows them to continuously extract energy from their environment minimizing the effort needed to stay airborne across vast stretches of open ocean, often traveling thousands of miles without landing. To truly master the skies, an albatross needs a body built for efficiency. Their bones are fascinating examples of evolutionary engineering. They're remarkably lightweight, almost hollow inside, yet incredibly strong. Think of it like this nature found a way to minimize weight without sacrificing structural integrity. This delicate balance is crucial because every ounce counts when you're aiming to glide effortlessly 
for thousands of miles over the open ocean. The lightness allows them to stay aloft longer with less energy expenditure and maintain their aerodynamic shape, further boosting their incredible soaring abilities. These magnificent birds are true masters of the ocean. Albatrosses often spend years, sometimes over a decade, continuously at sea before even returning to land to breed. It's an astonishing feat of endurance and navigation. Think about it, these birds can undertake single foraging trips that cover distances exceeding 60,000 kilometers or roughly 37,000 miles. That's further than the circumference of the Earth. They essentially disappear from our view for extended periods silently traversing vast stretches of ocean in search of food. Spending so much time soaring over the open ocean presents a unique challenge for albatrosses managing their salt intake. They consume salt water unintentionally while feeding on fish and squid, and naturally through mist and spray. To combat this, they possess specialized salt glands located near their eyes. These remarkable glands act like tiny filtration systems, efficiently extracting excess salt from their bloodstream. The concentrated brine is then excreted through pores near the nostrils, appearing as droplets of visible demonstration of their incredible adaptation for life at sea. This process prevents dehydration and allows them to maintain proper bodily functions during those incredibly long flights. It's truly remarkable how these magnificent birds navigate across such vast oceans. Albatrosses undertake incredible journeys, some traveling tens of thousands of miles each year to feed and breed. What's even more astonishing is their pinpoint accuracy in returning to the same breeding colonies, often located on remote islands. Scientists believe they possess an extraordinary sense of direction, relying heavily on Earth's magnetic fields as a sort of internal compass. They seem able to detect subtle variations in these fields, allowing them to maintain course across open water. Beyond magnetism, there's growing evidence suggesting albatrosses might also use scent cues detecting airborne molecules carried by the wind to help orient themselves. Imagine relying on those senses over thousands of miles. It's a testament to their evolutionary adaptation and truly highlights just how sophisticated these animals are. Learning to fly isn't just about flapping your wings for young albatrosses. It's a masterclass in gliding. These incredible birds spend months on land after hatching, but eventually they must take to the skies and harness the power of the wind. It's during this crucial period that parents play an absolutely vital role. They don't simply push their chicks off a cliff. Instead, they actively demonstrate the complex maneuvers required for efficient soaring. Watch how the parent dips a wing, subtly adjusting its angle to catch a gust. The chick mimics this action instinctively. These lessons involve countless repetitions and corrections, a gentle nudge here, a visual cue there, until the young albatross begins to understand the nuances of using air currents. It's truly remarkable to see this intergenerational transfer of survival skills, a silent language passed down through generations that ensures these magnificent birds continue their epic journeys across the ocean. This incredible gliding ability isn't just impressive, it's absolutely essential to the albatross survival. 
Imagine spending almost your entire life soaring over vast stretches of open ocean that's their reality. They can cover immense distances with minimal effort, using air currents and wind patterns to stay aloft for hours, even days at a time. This efficiency allows them to access feeding grounds far beyond what most other birds could reach. Think about it krill swarms, schools of fish. Squid these resources are often scattered across the ocean surface and without the ability to glide effortlessly, an albatross simply couldn't afford to travel to them. Their mastery of the air is their key to unlocking a rich food supply in this challenging environment.